already know what it is. All I do is work. So, check this out, guys. I have, I've gotten um, almost $900 this week for no apparent reason. Um, I wouldn't say no reason, but completely unexpected. Um, I think it has a lot to do with that, like I was telling you, that, that mindset, that thinking positivity, thinking the things that you want and need, you know, um, believing that you will get them. I, uh, I don't know. I just said that in a video, what, last week? And now I got like $250 given to me by my work for like no reason. It didn't make any sense. It, it wasn't, I don't know. And it came on a Monday, which is weird. Our payday is Friday, but it was like, I just got a random deposit into my account. Um, so I'm like, oh, shit, that stuff must be working, man. Um, and then today I go into the, uh, the doctor where I had the vasectomy. And, um, I was just there for a, an appointment. And they said, oh, while you're here, we have a, uh, a credit that needs to come back to you. I'm like, really? Like, yeah, um, looks like 600 six hundred some dollars I'm like shut up I didn't say shut up I was like really um, okay you know it's like I don't I don't question things but it's I, I told the lady I said uh, I said I don't normally question when people just want to give me money um, but I'm curious and she said that after all this time it's been two months now since the procedure that the insurance company decided to cover the whole thing, which is insane, because before it was like they were gonna cover almost nothing, um, just a small amount. But um, yeah, and we really need the money right now. There's a lot of things happening where we need we need the extra money, and um, God provides. Pretty cool. To deadlift I haven't deadlifted in a couple months just because my lower back has been kind of tweaked that's why um, I stopped deadlifting um, probably a few weeks before my uh, operation and so I'm getting back into it and I'm gonna take it really slow and work my way up and we're gonna try to not today, but we're gonna try to work towards PR. So today's just kind of a getting back into it type deal. I'll probably just go up to like 185 or 205 or something like that. And just try to get my form back. And um, over the next few months, the goal is to get the deadlift up. Um, yeah, I'm trying to get to a, I don't know. If I can work up to 315 in the next couple months, I'll be happy. So, as you say, I, as you saw, I did some uh, foam rolling, and um, I'm doing a lot of warm-up movements. I really don't want to re-injure myself, so I'll take it nice and slow. Oh, another thing that I'm changing here is that um, before. 
I tweaked my lower back, and before my operation, I was doing uh, I was doing push pull legs, and uh, my legs day or lower body day is the day I would do deadlifting. I'm gonna see if I can increase my deadlift by kind of giving it its own day. And I'm gonna I'm gonna start deadlifting on pull day, and I'm gonna deadlift first thing because it does deadlifting <clears throat> works the entire posterior chain, back hamstrings, glutes. Um, so what we're going to do is try to put it on that day, try to put it on the pull day. I was, like I said, I was doing it on leg day before, which is fine. You can do both, but in my experience, one, one lift or the other is going to suffer if you do them both in the same day. So if you deadlift first, your squats are going to suffer. If you squat first, then your deadlift strength is going to suffer. So what I'm trying to do is separate them so I can get the best out of both of them and uh, hopefully hit some PRs here soon. And while you're at it, give me the badge, because I'm the sheriff. Everybody back up! Push through, at least uh, get familiar with the movement again. It's only 135 on the bar, so obviously it's lightweight, literally. But we'll get it up there in no time. Everybody back up. I'm about to tear it up now. I'm about to tear it up. I'm about to tear it up now. Up. Everybody back up. I run this. I run that. I run this. Everybody back up. Everybody back up. I want that. I want that. I want that. I'm bigger than a back, 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 back truck. I want that. I want that. Everybody back up. I want that. I want that. I want that. I'm bigger than a back, 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 back truck. What's up guys? It's uh, 
like you saw, 155. And this is actually my first meal. This is a buffalo chicken. It's like pre-cooked chicken you can buy. So I'm gonna have some of this. And I think I'm gonna just have some dark red kidney beans. Maybe, maybe like two servings of it. And uh, I'm just gonna mix it together. Eat it like that. <clears throat> Get some fiber in. I haven't been hitting my fiber very well lately, so. All right. This is how I train forearms. That vascularity though. Yeah. Thank you.